One of the most exciting pieces of this winter's launch to me is the Hook Doctor. Um, the Hook Doctor is a revolution in hook sharpening because it brings the benefits of a mechanical and electric device um, to everyone. When I did start pinpoint hooks, I was only able to do it because I was sharpening my hooks on a device, on a big machine that I put together with the help of a friend of mine. Um, the problem with that is that it is, like I said, really big, so it's not for everyone. Not everyone has space to do it or wants to do it you know, in such a high quantity. So, yeah, between me and Kev and some other people, we put our heads together and came up with the idea of the Hook Doctor. Uh, the Hook Doctor can be operated in both directions, which enables you to sharpen your hooks from both sides and even though if you're left or right-handed. Um, it got a security guard on here, which can be removed, A, to uh, change the grinding wheel, or if you prefer to uh, grind your hooks on the top of the grinding wheel, which some people do. An additional extra that we put in the range together with the Hook Doctor is the Hook Doctor vise. When using a more compact machine, I actually prefer using the vise uh, compared to when I used to sharpen my hooks on a big machine, just because it gives me more control, more accuracy, and um, also a better view of what I'm actually doing when I'm sharpening my hooks. The Hook Doctor comes in a hard case with the USB-C port on the side and once fully charged, it runs for hours. That gives you enough time to sharpen dozens and dozens of hooks. The way how I tend to use it is I lock a hook into the vise, which gives me the best handling and the best feeling for what I'm actually doing. Um, and then I start by sharpening both sides before I go to sharpen the top section of the hook, which is always the last step that I tend to do. I would even go so far that if you're fishing smaller hook sizes, like size 8 and upwards, I would only tend to sharpen the top section of the hook, so the outside of the hook, because you take away uh, too much material, which can result in a ruined hook, basically. But I'm a firm believer of that there's absolutely no rights and wrongs when it comes to hook sharpening. Whatever suits you right and gives you the best results in the end and the sharpest hooks is what you should do for you and tell me about it so I know. Thank <laughs> you.